Uh, the United States has vowed real consequences for China if it moves ahead with providing lethal aid to Russia. The comments were made by National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan, who say that the decision now lies on Beijing as to how it proceeds with regards to military assistance. Here now is a report. Even though China has not moved toward providing lethal aid to assist Russia's invasion of Ukraine, the United States has made clear behind closed doors that such a move would have serious consequences. That's according to White House National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan. He told CNN on Sunday, quote, Beijing will have to make its own decisions about how it proceeds, whether it provides military assistance. But if it goes down that road, it will come at real cost to China. The United States and its NATO allies in recent days have been scrambling to dissuade China from such a move, uh, aid to uh, Russia, making public comments on their behalf that China is considering providing lethal equipment to Russia. Okay. The comments come as protesters across the globe are calling for an end to the war now in its second year and days after U.S. President Joe Biden met with Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky, promising new American military aid worth $500 million. Chairman of the U.S. House Foreign Affairs Committee Michael McCall cited reports that drones are among the lethal weapons China has considered sending to Russia. Russia and China signed a no-limits partnership last February before Russian forces invaded Ukraine. Economic links between Russia and China have deepened, and so far, China has not condemned the conflict. The West reacted with skepticism to China's proposal on Friday for a Ukraine ceasefire. Council members should not be fooled by calls for a temporary or unconditional ceasefire. Ukraine rejected the proposal unless it involves Russia withdrawing its troops. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.